Hello, my name is Joe Valone, and on today's episode of Backcountry Essentials, I'd like to show you a technique called Baton Ramasse. This is a hybrid version of a French technique called Piolet Ramasse. Instead of using the ice axe, we will use the ski poles. This skill can be useful when you are faced with tricky sections and you don't have immediate access to your ice axe. Some examples could be narrow passages that might be icy or firm and filled with rocks. Or anytime you find yourself in a situation where you want to sidestep with more security to get around or over an obstacle. Start by holding the poles with one hand near the baskets and the other hand near the grips. Hold the poles across your body with the baskets pointed into the snow perpendicular to 90 degrees. It is important that you don't lean on the poles as a crutch, but use them more for stability and balance. This is mostly accomplished by keeping your body upright and perpendicular to gravity. Move slowly in balance and only move the poles when you are not moving your feet. It is best to sidestep in static movements. This will allow for more control versus side slipping, which can create momentum that might be harder to manage, especially if you slide into a rock or worse, a hidden patch of ice. One of the biggest mistakes with this technique is putting too much weight on the poles. Your weight should be over your skis and your body should stay upright. If you lean on your poles as a crutch, this will cause your body to lay into the slope. This takes your weight off of your edges and can result in a slip. And there you go, a new trick to put in your tool belt, Baton Ramas.